guys, Tommy here. I'm just going to do an unboxing of the solar lights for the fairy garden that you saw featured in the Camelot garden tour. So the lights are made by Illuminated Garden. They are 30 LEDs, solar dragonflies is the look. It's basically a standard set of solar lights with dragon shaped dragonfly shaped shaves over the top so without further ado i'll unbox it and then we'll also show you it being fitted outside around my cherry tree so out the box as i should have said to you in the beginning it's basically not as normal standard set of Solar string lights with your solar panel, which can also sit in the ground if you wished on a stake. And in the bag you have dragonfly shaped shells to go over the light bulbs. So basically, if I press the switch on the back, there you go. You've got your red and yellow bulbs, and you've got your green and blue bulbs. Although they're slightly blended in on the video, because you can't really see a green one. So let's see if I can pull a green one out separately from the, the blue. There you go, see? Blue and green. And you just basically put the shells over the bulbs and then you wrap round the area you want it to go. And you stick this stay in the bottom of the controller and you stick the sun the sundial so it gets the light and such charges the battery. It takes one times double A battery, a 1.2 volt, 300 mAh me. MH rechargeable battery. The bulbs are not replaceable, but if the light set ever failed, my recommendation is basically just get a normal standard solar powered set of swing lights and just change the shells onto them. Okay, so next part of this video will be showing you than being fitted outside and starting the fairy, fairy garden project on my garden outside. So, see you in the next part. Hey guys, welcome back to part two. And as you can see, I have put the dragonfly swing lights in place around my cherry tree from the bottom and I'll show you where it's at top. As you've seen in the previous video you can see how tall it is. And I've got the solar powered stake up in there. If I plug in static mode you can see them flash. Or you can see the static. So join me for part three, and you'll see him in the night mode. See you next one, guys. Okay, guys, welcome back to part three of the video, and now it's night mode. Now you can see the dragonfly swing lights in action. That is in static mode. And if I flick the switch to the opposite way to F, you should see them. There we go. You should see them flash. So I'll stand back. You might get the security lights come on in the video. And I'll stand back, you can get the full effect of the tree. There we go.
I'm not going to do a static one, as, as you can tell what it's going to be like static. So, that's my Dragonfly string lights uh, all done. That's the first part of the fairy garden to, uh, is completed. So the rest of the project um, will be down up on the garden here. And we can see the dark, but uh, which you get your light. I've already got my pixie there. There's a little boy rabbit in the corner, but he's going to have a string of solar uh, fairy houses. I'm going to get me out of the way. Fairy houses in the corner, and there's going to be a pack of fairy garden with fairies and everything around there. There's going to be like a solar doorway at the end of the tree so it's like leading up into tree like people's living in the tree fairies living in the tree there's also going to be like a water feature around here as well so step one is complete stay tuned for the next steps as I collect each part and unbox them on the channel um for the fairy garden guys and I will leave links in the description now the link for this won't be the exact one I've got here because I got this from a garden centre but there is the same one on Amazon which I will link in for that so if they would like right to purchase these they can with that the aesthetic of the garden now, guys. So step one's already complete. Okay. So, I have been your host, Tommy. I will see you on the next.